South Florida, Fort Lauderdale, Florida, the lot of Zion. We coming with the truth by shoving my shot, Hallelujah! 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 The Most High said he's coming, and he's sending his only begotten son, who you call Jesus Christ, real name of Yahweh who is a black man according to the Bible. That's right. He's sending him to bring high those that have been set low. And who's low in this place in us? Read. That those which mourn may be exalted and we to, mourn satis to we, safety. We mourn it every day and said we shall be exalted to safety. We in this safety right now. That's right. That's we right. worry every time we walk out the house, one of these crackers gonna kill us, one of our own brothers gonna kill us, right? The food we eat. All of that, man. We are not in safety, but the Most High gonna put us in safety. Read. Right. Verse 12. He disappointed the devices of the crafty. He disappointed the devices of the crafty. The white man is the crafty. He has all these devices. He has an entire system set up in this country to destroy us, to bring us down, to exterminate us. That's right. The Most right. High God said he gonna disappoint all of us. Right. Read on. So that their hands cannot perform their enterprise. That's right, their enterprise, what they want to perform is the extermination of the nation of Israel. That's right. Who is the nation of Israel? And sure ain't none of y'all walking around who got the last name Cohen. None of y'all walking around who got the last name Levi. You're looking right. at the real Cohen, the real Levi, the real right. Judah, the real Benjamin. All right, all the way on down to all the tribes. Right? Read that again. He disappointed the devices of the craft. He's disappointed your device, Reed. So that their hands cannot perform their enterprise. Right, the enterprise of the extermination of black Latino and Native Indians. As you're doing through all this murder, all this rape, right? All these vaccines you're pumping into our kids. All this poison you're pumping into our food. That's right. The Lord said he's going to disappoint all of your enterprise. Read on. That's Verse 13. He taketh the wise in their own craftiness. You're so wise. You're so intelligent. You done figured out how to deceive the whole planet Earth, how to trick everybody off the damn streets. The Most High said in that same device, he gonna take you out, white man. Read. And the council of the forward uh -huh. is carried the council, headlong. The council of the forward, man. Who is the forward? That word means perverse. And there is not one more perverted, diabolical animal on the Earth than the man that called himself a Caucasian. That's right. And he said he gonna disappoint all that. He said he gonna cast you down headlong. Meaning take you at the top of a damn building. One World Trade Center, whatever the hell that is, and throw you off of them. That's what he gonna do. That's right. Better physically through the spirit, man. That's right. They meet with darkness in the daytime. Uh -huh, they meet with darkness in the daytime. That's their secret councils. That's your elite, your Illuminati, whatever you want to call them. They meet with secret councils in the daytime. And the main enterprise that they're trying to fulfill in their secret councils is the extermination of the chosen of the Most High God. That's right. Like better than Native Indian. But that's never gonna happen. The Most High said you can never bring a fool into his people. Man. That's right. Read on. It says, and grow in the noonday uh -huh. as in the night. Read on. But he saveth the poor from the sword. But he's gonna save the poor. One third of the nation of Israel will be saved from the sword that's that you got right. for That's right. All right? He's gonna be saved, all right? Of the black, Hispanic, and Native Indian, and not no one else. Read on. From their mouth uh -huh. and from the hand of the mighty. That's right, from the mouth. The mouth of what? The mouth of the great red dragon that has been devouring us since he came into power in the Roman Empire. That's right. The same great red dragon that tried to devour our savior, Hamashiach Yahweh Shah, upon his birth. Right? The same red dragon that drove us out of our land and into Africa. Which is why you're calling yourself an African American now. You were driven into that land. We come from Israel as blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians. That's the red right. dragon, we're going to get saved from him. Read. Verse 16. So the poor had hope. And iniquity stop with her mouth. That's right. The poor have hope, man. The poor have hope. What's the hope? That we come back to the law, statutes, and commandments, and have faith in the Mashiach Yahweh Shah. And if we do that, 
we're going to get saved out of this place. And all the iniquity of the wicked will be stopped. And the devil will be stopped, man. Read. That was 16. Proverbs chapter 4, verse 7. Go ahead. Wisdom is the principal thing. Wisdom is the principal thing. Read on. Therefore, get wisdom. Therefore, get wisdom. And that's what's going on. People is not getting wisdom. We got two grown ass black men running around here dressed as little babies right next to us. They're not getting no damn wisdom. Most High said wisdom is the principal thing. Get wisdom. We the only ones out here preaching this true wisdom through the spirit of Prophet Yahweh. That's right. And with all that getting, get understanding. With all that getting, get understanding. Our people lack so much understanding that it's sick. And here we are out here giving you the understanding through the spirit. And you niggas think it's a show. We don't got no damn half for you to put no dollars in, man. You need to take what we say into consideration. That's right. It's the only thing that's going to get you out of this. It's her. And she shot with protected me. That's right. Promote thee. Exalt her, exalt wisdom, and she shall promote thee. So we talked about the promotion of us into rulership on this earth, out of our low place. But the only way we can do that is through wisdom, through the law, statutes, and commandments, through this Torah. That is the only way we're going to accomplish our promotion, our exaltation. It's through wisdom. So we beseech all blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans, pursuing to your patrilineage, lineage, to come back to this wisdom, to come back to this Torah. Read. She shall bring thee to honor. That's right. She shall bring thee to honor. Wisdom is going to bring you to honor. Money ain't going to bring you to honor. Bulls ain't going to bring you to honor. Jewelry ain't going to bring you to honor. Wisdom is going to bring you to honor. That's right. We're trying to right. bring our people to honor. That's right. When thou embrace her. Uh -huh. When thou embrace her. But our people, they just walk in by. They cast them what we do it to the side. They're not embracing wisdom. And then they wonder why we get murdered in the street. They wonder why we broke. They wonder why we in jail. They wonder why we got AIDS. It's because we're not embracing wisdom. Proverbs chapter 4, verse 9. She shall give thee thy own head, woman of grace. That's right, anointment of grace. That grace is only come upon us if we embrace with freedom. A crown of glory uh -huh. shall she deliver to thee. That's right, a crown of glory shall she deliver to us. We're trying to get that crown of glory. We're trying to get that rule. She's going to keep going. Here, oh my son. Uh -huh. Here, oh my son. Where's Here, he? what's, your, what's your nationality, man? You're a Mexican, right? Your father Mexican, right? So hear this word. You need to get this wisdom. You know the history of the Mexican? You know the history of the Aztec, right? There's a man named Quetzalcoatl in the Aztec, right? You know who that is? That's your God, right? That's Jesus Christ in the Bible. Black, oh, uh, woolly head, right? Crucified. Well, matter of fact, go ahead and give me that. I'm going to show you that Quetzalcoatl was talking about in the Bible. We're going to prove it, right? So go ahead, with Isaiah 6. Go ahead, right? Book of Isaiah, chapter 6, verse 2. Uh -huh. And above it stood the seraphim. Yes, sir. You know what a seraphim is? In the Hebrew, that means a fiery flying serpent. Ain't that what Quetzalcoatl was? Read. Each one has six wings. Got wings, right? Read on. With twain, he covered his face. With his face, read. And with twain, he covered his feet. With his feet, read. He did block. He flew. Read on. And one cried unto another and said, Holy, holy, holy is the Lord of hosts. That's right. the, whole, the, uh, the whole earth is full of his glory. And the post of the door moved at the voice of him that cried. Read on. And the house was filled with smoke. Uh -huh. Then said I, what was me? For I am undone. Right. Read on. Because I am a man of unclean lips. Unclean lips. We men of unclean lips out here, right? Now, but watch this. Read. And I dwell in the midst of a people of unclean lips. For my eyes have seen the King, the Lord of hosts. Uh -huh. Then the one of the seraphim unto me. So here come one of these feathered serpents, right, Reed? Having a live coal in his hand. He got a live coal. That's a purifying agent. That's what coal is used for, right, Reed? Which he had taken with the tongue from off the altar. Read on. And he laid it upon my mouth uh -huh. and said, Lo, uh -huh. this have touched my lips, uh -huh. and thine iniquity is taken away. He took away his iniquity. Only Christ can take away the sins of the world. That's right. So that's special photo. That's where they get that whole contract from. Because the Mexican man is there like Right, that's right, that's right. That's right, we gotta stick together, go ahead. And I see first. Right, so, so uh, but I had to hold. Deuteronomy 4, 5, 6. Deuteronomy chapter 4, verse 5. Behold, I have taught you statutes and judgments, even as the Lord my power commanded me. That's right, we've been taught law, statutes, and commandments. Read. It says, even as the Lord thy power has commanded me, uh -huh. that ye should do.
do so in the land whether you go to possess it. He therefore do this. But this is your wisdom. This is our wisdom. These laws, that you commandments, the Torah, this is our wisdom. This is what we got to keep. The reason why we go through hell right now, we destroy, is because we did not keep that Torah. So we got to come back to that. Man. That's right. We did that to ourselves. Now we got to fix ourselves. But this devil is not going to fix us. We going to fix ourselves through the right. With the same thing, the most high gave us is jump. Right? right. So read. And by understanding in the sight of the nation. That's right. In the sight of the nation. Because we're not following these laws, and commandments. Now the nation will look at us like we dumb spits and things, right? That's right? But that's all right. When we come back to these laws, and commandments, that's going to be out the window, man. All right? That's going to be out here beseeching our people, begging our people to come, come back to these laws, and commandments. We shall hear all these statutes and say, surely this great nation is a wise and understanding people. We're supposed to be a wise and understanding people. The Most High God gave us the whole game, gave us the whole blueprint. We dumb as hell for the second. But now we gotta be smart. We gotta come back to it. Keep going. You said what? Technology has its own development. Well, before technology, but that's all right. We just gotta go on that path regardless. We gotta get back on the right track. Right? So we Verse 7. For what nation is there so great? Uh -huh. Who had the most high so nigh unto them? Don't nobody got God close to them like we do. Right. We the chosen people. Right. We the ones that's everywhere. But hey, brother, don't do that side of the cross. Because that's fake. Don't deal with that Catholicism. But I'm gonna explain something to you. What we explain it right now, the reason why we're here is because of that. The most high didn't say do no sign of the cross. That goes back to what Babylonian deity, yeah? See, but listen, but listen, what has that got you? It got me, it got me to the place I am right now. And you know where you at right now? In slavery, with the Spaniards right. last name. Right. That's where you at. I'm right? So fight it, and, fighting. and that's what was given you in slavery. So a part of fighting slavery is letting the master religion go and come back to the truth of the Bible. That's what we gotta do, huh? Go ahead. We say to the, so we say, we shall hear all these statutes and say, uh -huh. surely this great nation is a wise and understanding people. We're supposed to be wise and understand. How do we get our wisdom and understanding back? We come back to these laws, statutes, and commandments. Okay. Straight like straight to the books, right? Read. But what nation is so great uh -huh. who had the most eyes so nigh unto them uh -huh. as the Lord our power right. is in all things that's that we why, call upon that's him why for? We excel with what we do. That's why we the greatest entertainers. That's why we the greatest athletes. Because we have God's most of us. That's right. We God's chosen. The rest of these people, they God's forsaken. Read on. Those are on that. All right, go on that. Matthew. 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 Matthew chapter 4, verse 17. Think not. Mashiach Yahweh Shah, you call Christ, who is not some white, weak, faggot, contrary to popular belief, right, right. a black revolutionary, who the most high said to be our Messiah. He said, I need to put it. Matthew chapter 5, verse 17. Think not that I am come to destroy the law. He said, I didn't come to destroy these laws. Because that's what they teach us in the church. You know why they teach us that in the church? Because they want us destroyed. That's what the whole church was designed to do. Keep us in subjugation to this devil. Yeah. Yeah.